Nael, you... I thought you were dead. I'm so glad. I... I was so sure you... I thought I'd really lost you for good this time. <laughs> What's up with that outfit, huh? Where'd you pick up a weird get-up, like... Matthew, no! It's not her! Huh? Not Nael. But it clearly is. How can you not recognize her? Oh, of course. You've never met her before. Hang on, I, I should have a photo. Matthew, look at me. The person you see before you isn't Nael. It is in part, but not wholly. Inside of her is Alpha. Huh? Not you too, eh? What is this? Who is this Alpha guy, anyway? I don't understand. What are you doing? Come quickly. Everyone's waiting. Matthew. Niall, hold up a minute, yeah? Seems there's something really confusing going on here. Alpha suddenly appeared one day. With the goal of destroying this world. Rex and I, and Zed too, we fought against Alpha to save the world from his rancor. Alpha's power is unparalleled. For all our efforts, it wasn't enough. Even our collective might failed to repel him. In the end, all we managed was to buy a fraction more time. Having tasted frustration in battle, Alpha understood. He realized he needed something to amplify his power. An avatar. <sighs> Nael is the Avatar, Matthew. The day the city fell, you didn't lose Nael because she went missing. Rather, she had become Alpha's vessel. No. Come on, A, not you two. I can't. What the hell is this? Can you stop making shit up? There'll be time for explaining later. For now, you've got to give her a real drubbing. Huh? Dropping? Not that violent. If at all possible, we will free Nile. And if it's not? If it's not, then better buckle up, kid. You can't be bloody serious! Hmm. You are in the way of our vision. Not hell. Say, what's so great about this world? Really? Or the thieving for one's own gain, the greed. Life has less value in this world than a piece of dirt. This is your world of peace. Oh. We don't need it. Do we, Matthew? Answer. <sighs> you disappoint me, truly. I didn't think you'd side with them. I haven't. I'm just... Enough of this. We will simply go alone then. Nael! Goodbye, my brother. Bastard! That's a hell of a lot more power than before. It's the Avatar. Her emotions are heightened. They're feeding straight into Alpha's power. <sighs> Nael! Hey, stop this! No, not him. Ed. If raw emotion is what affords him strength, it must be disrupted with emotion stronger still. You fail to reach such a zenith. Alpha. I, Ed, shall thwart you once more. My blade will cut your very will! Sword of the end, you're you. Sure about that? I am Niall. I am divorced of all that. All doubts. Misgivings gone!
Again, Alpha. Really. Nio! It is over. No! Ah! <sighs> it's you. Like killing Grandad wasn't enough for you? Now, Niall, do! Huh? The hell are you playing at, eh? Why? You must not lash out at him. Matthew. He's not your enemy. I promise you. Stop talking shite! He's trying to kill Niall! He killed Grandad! And you're... He is... your flesh and blood. What? Stronger even than my own. <laughs> Think you've bought yourself some time? We may not have much, but it's more than we need to erase you. Quite. Well then, I'm happy to wait. For you both, yes? Time to spare. What? Eternity. Sorry? My due. In return for protecting this world, Zed promised me eternity. An eternal present in which to abide. Zed? Is that the Mobius head honcho? What do you even do with eternity? For starters, you Mobius... Bastard. That's the reason for this. I'm sure you plan to pursue them. And yet I will not let you reach them. Before you can interpose yourself, I will cut Alpha down. You'd do well to remember that. You serious? Even now? She's your flesh and blood too! <laughs> <laughs> 